Hi guys, it's Daily Science here, and in this video, I'm going to show you guys another cool science experiment. So for this video, you will need a measuring cup, a glass of water, and a hollow tube or a straw. So for this video, I'm going to put green food coloring inside the water so you guys can see it more clearly. So now you have to take your hollow tube or straw, and as you can see, this is a hollow tube. Let me focus that for you. It's a hollow tube on both ends, and you're gonna have to put the liquid all the way to halfway through the tube, so like around here, and then hold your thumb at the other end to stop it from going back into the cup. So as you can see, it's still in the straw when you hold the finger in, and just put it. Squeeze it down, like that. So now it's like that in the tube, and take your thumb, hold it. Just make sure it doesn't flick water everywhere, because it happened to me. And now, the water is, you can't see it too properly, but the green water is up to here, right there, and just let go of it. Wait, I'm just going to redo that, and I'll get back to you. So, I got it more than halfway through the tube, and then I'm just going to have to go ahead and drop it into the other container. And as you can see, the other container is getting filled with the water. So it stops working after the water reaches to around the point where the tube is. So right now it just stopped working. And now I'm going to pour all the water to this side. And just because this glass is more clear, you probably can see it more clear. So I'm going to put all the water to this side and put it, try to siphon it all into this cup. So I'll be back when I'm done setting it up. So this time I put more water into the measuring cup so that the water moves it more water moves into this glass so you guys can see it for a longer time so I'm going to show you guys that right now and just to tell you guys once the water levels out the tube will not transfer any more water it will just stop and stay pretty much still so it will only work until the water level equal, just becomes equal in both containers. So as you guys can see the water is emptying into the glass. So now I'm just going to leave it and speed up this clip.
So once again, both water levels are almost similar. This one is practically equal with this one. And at that point, the water will stop. It will stop transferring water. So that's about it for this video. You guys can also give me suggestions in the comments for what experiments you guys want to see me do next. And I'll try to do it if I can. And yeah, thanks for watching. Please rate, comment, and subscribe.